a where is it awesome sinks since we have lots of room here I'll do this over like right here Okay, where are you? Oh, I was looking for the merger. Then we'll have splitter here and splitter over here. Floor's too steep. All right, so I'm going to need a lift there. Encroaching other... Oh. Okay. So... Um... Okay, so that's how it goes. Put the lift over here. There. That way, all of these things can continue working. Now they're just emptying out their inventories, but... We got more oil production, so that should hopefully do something about these uh, fuel generators. But we also need to set up our petroleum coke production area. So it would have to be like over here. We just don't have room for it. Or maybe we can start turning this into MK2s because I think we're going to need it. Okay, so let's turn all of these into MK2s just so all of the oil from over there can travel over here. Like, I don't think it's going to go back up because of this vertical incline. Probably. Alright, that should be enough. Start building foundations over here. Wait, no. Oh, we can't do this anymore. But we do have concrete in there, so yes, we can continue doing this. That's exactly why I put stuff in these boxes. Just so I don't have to go all the way back. But I probably will, simply because I don't have enough concrete. Yeah, so these foundations reaches all the way over here. Now I can also blow up some of these things. Except I can't because I don't have uh, the explosives. Alright, now it's time to go back. So are these working now? Are we storing fuel? Okay, we're storing a little bit. Finally getting some oil in here. So, alright then. Okay, this is still going. All of your inventory is gone, which is good. 
except for plastic. Plastic is kind of, uh, not doing too well. It's still fully loaded. Okay, I, the entrance to the hypertubes is over there. We need to go back our, to our base. We need to get some explosives and we need lots of concrete. I think we're finally getting there. Got our extra heavy oil production going. And we're doing something about these excess plastic and rubber so that even more oil production will happen. Now we just need to convert some of that heavy oil into petroleum coke. And then I think what I'm going to do is set up trucks, have them drive around this place and then dump it near our aluminum production area. Just so that I don't have to build out all of these, like, conveyors. It's much easier to just set up the, uh, trucks delivering stuff. And on top of that, we also have fuel production, like, packaged fuel production. So we can use that. We don't need to connect, like, coal to fuel our trucks. Okay, so our explosives are all the way in here. Just need one stack of it. And then we need the rest concrete. How are we on the rest of these items? Okay, we haven't been using these computers. Maybe we should like get rid of them? Maybe? I'll put you here. Now, we probably should get some extra copper sheets because we're low on that. Still have a few more, but... Here we go. Here's the autosave. And then we get lots of concrete. It might as well take all of this, since we're building out lots of foundations. And may as well top up our iron plates here. And our rods. There we go. And let's go back. You know, before we go, I should test this out. So I cannot destroy this. This is not destroyable. All right then. It was worth a shot. Like those crash sites are actually getting in the way of my building. So hopefully, maybe in like a new, in update 4, we can probably do something about that. Just so we can clear stuff out and make the area more buildable. Okay, so how's the conveyors over here? Okay, rubber is empty. Plastic is still, like, not going. So we probably have to do more for plastic. Maybe we can get rid of the rubber? I have an idea. Let's turn these into MK1s, the rubber. Just so we can bottleneck it. And then... Splitters... Put this here. 
just so we can have more plastic going in here. And I guess we can also convert these into MK4s. Just so it can move faster. We don't really need to change over the conveyors that are outputting the refineries. Just need it over here. And that should do it. Is there a bottleneck here? Nope, no bottleneck whatsoever. So everything is now being shoved into the awesome sink. And you know what? I don't think I need the second uh, output anymore. Just get rid of this. Yeah, there we go. You know what? I should probably grade these as well. This way, once the plastic starts being used in the factory. Half of it will go into this awesome sink and half of it will go into the truck stop. Okay, so anyway, back to building out the foundations for our petroleum coke. Now that all of our refineries are going. Shouldn't be a problem anymore. Yeah, we're starting to build up our... Uh, fuel. But not as much as I would like. Yeah, but we're still okay. Oh, we should check how much power we're actually consuming. Okay, we're still fine. Maybe I should build it a little bit closer to the shore, like this area over here. We need to fill in this area anyway. And I also need to blow up those rocks. Those very annoying rocks. Ouch. Did I just blow myself? No, I didn't. In fact, my health is low. I should eat these berries.
Uh, can I blow this up? Yes, I can. I also grab these nuts. Also get rid of the tree here. Alright, so... Let's fill in this space. this okay so we got a nice clean area and we should probably use this area for the truck stop Also grab these nuts as well. Can I blow up this thing? No, I can't. What about this part over here? Okay, so I can't get rid of that. Alright, so let's start our production area here. Uh, we will need... What do we need for coke? It's the refinery. Oh, petroleum coke. It just needs heavy oil. That's it. Nothing else. Okay. Alright, let's start making the production area. We need to turn this around. One, two, three. Maybe we should make like four for the time being. How much do you need? You need 40 per minute. And you make 12 petroleum coke. Yeah, so I think we only need like four of these in total. And if we need more, we can just expand in that direction over there. Okay, so let's get to it. Alright, let's put our pipes back into the hot bar. A cross junction over here. And start building towards our heavy oil. that. Okay, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna need more plastic. First, let's start building these 
pipeline support. Yeah, that works. Put some foundations here as well. And we need to get more plastic now. No, plastic is over here. No. I guess we do need one of these. Just one full stack. And then we'll get our plastic from this constructor over here. Oh, this is on standby, so it's not going to produce anything. And for good measure, let's also put down another industrial fluid buffer. And then we'll put cross junction in here. We, it doesn't fit. Damn you. Okay, you know what? Let's just do this. Okay, now it's flowing. Alright, so we'll connect these up. Put our cross junctions here. Okay, it's flowing, but there's no power. Let's fix that. It's one, two, three, four. Then we'll connect this over here, except we can't. But you know what? Let's change this over to an MK2. There we go. Alright, so now we got the petroleum coke going. Alright, it's time to put back our... Wait, no. It's over here. Conveyors on the hot bar. Alright, so now we are producing petroleum coke. Now I have to wonder, it, can petroleum coke be used for fuel in the truck? You know, let's check this out. want the truck or tractor no, let's do a truck let's get some let's go get some rubber and then 
we'll get like one truck going. Wait, it would be faster if we got it over there because we're storing rubber now. Oh, come on. Do not try to uh, slide on those pipes because it has little notches that prevent you from like moving. The storage is all the way over there though. Oh yeah, we need beacons. And we are low on concrete, so we'll just save it for now. Let's build an equipment shop. So we need 10 of these beacons. Now we can build the truck. Oh wow. So it has no fuel in it. Let's take some petroleum coke then. Drive truck. Oh there you are. Yeah, we can use the petroleum coke for fuel. Except he uses a lot of petroleum coke, so let's not. Like, he already used up, like, three petroleum coke just from that little turn there. So, what I'd like to do is just bring the fuel over here. Okay, so let's do a conveyor like right here. Okay, where's the conveyor poles? And we'll put you right here. And then we'll start bringing the fuel over there. Okay, let's turn this back on. Needs a second level. Forgot about that. Yeah, there we go. It's one, two. Alright, so we'll put it like this. And put the petroleum coke up here. And we should probably add more foundations here.
And let's put our truck station like right here. Okay, we will have to put some ramps there. But we should be fine. Yeah, the fuel is on the top level there. Then bring the petroleum coke in here. Bring the fuel over here. Oh, we also need to power this up. Can't forget that. Wait, unload. Yeah, we're supposed to be loading in here, right? Or I didn't hook this up. That's why. Okay, so the fuel will be used for, well, fuel, and then the petroleum coke will be used for, uh, transport. That's done. And this needs fuel. Okay, so let's get one stack of this, put it into the truck. Okay. 